All right, guys, we are back. Hello, um, post number five. So why Young Living? I don't know, right? You kind of ask, you're gonna ask that, right? Why not um, some other companies out there? Why not Walmart? Why not Bed Bath & Beyond? Why not Barnes & Noble? Um, what is the deal with all the oils, all the price differences, all the different? What makes Young Living different? Um, and I'm gonna tell you. Um, so here's the deal, guys. Um, the essential oil that you're going to purchase from an over-the-counter store or your health food store, those are perfume-grade oils. Um, they're no good. Okay, so here's the reason. If you want them only for the diffusing aspect, maybe, maybe not. So this industry is regulated under the cosmetics industry, and here in the United States, that industry has not been regulated since the early 1940s. Um, there are hundreds of chemicals and synthetics that are allowed in products like essential oils, um, but also personal care products like shampoo, uh, makeup, skin care, lotions, baby care, cleaning, um, all that type of stuff. Um, there are so many chemicals that are now allowed in those products um, that have not been tested for safety, nor do they need to be. And that is scary stuff um, because not only is that stuff not tested for safety, that right there um, is scary enough, but there is also um, documented proof and evidence showing that many of these chemicals that we're exposed to for many, many things that we're allowing in our homes actually do cause asthma, respir other respiratory issues, eczema, um, all sorts of stuff, allergies, huge one. Um, and we're bringing all that into our home, mostly because we just don't know any better. Um, so here is the Young Living difference, and we'll touch more on that later. Um, but the real kicker with why Young Living um, is we are almost 30-year-old company, over 30-year-old company, we are a billion dollar company. We are the oldest, most well-respected company in the entire world when it comes to essential oils. We are the only company that owns our own farms um, and grows organic practices, organic, sustainable farming practices. Um, we do have co-op farms and work with partner farms, um, but there are always young living people on those farms round the clock to make sure they're living up to our standards. So what does that mean for you? Um, so the other oils that you're gonna be having out there, if you don't know how the plant was farmed, well, first of all, grown from the time the seed went in the soil, um, from the time it was put in the soil, grown, taken care of, harvested and distilled, if you don't know the process going into that, then chances are it's not that's not a good thing. You wanna know what's happening. You wanna know that it's organic. You wanna know that the farming practices are sustainable. And you also wanna know how it's being distilled because the distillation is key to the end product being a pure therapeutic grade essential oil. Um, and while we touch on that, um, that's what makes the difference. That phrase, pure therapeutic grade essential oil, I feel confident in saying that with Young Living. Um, I have been to one of our farms. I will be to another in June in just a little over a month. Um, but I've been to Idaho to our Highland Flats farm um, and it's amazing. It is awe inspiring. The workers there are just incredible. I have helped cut, chop, load, cook, distill, and been a part of the process um, and seen it firsthand. And anybody is welcome to do this. And that is just incredible. Um, you wanna know what you're putting in and on your family. And if you're buying something over the counter from a health food store, it's not what you are expecting it to be. So they fill it with synthetics and additives, uh, stuff, stuff like alcohol um, and chemical stuff that's not good. Um, you can typically smell a difference right from the get-go if you're smelling a good oil versus something that's perfume grade or even lower grade than that. Um, so I personally like to live a know thy farmer type lifestyle um, and try to live that philosophy when it comes to my family. Um, so it's really important to me to know where um, my food is grown. So it's also important to know where the plants are grown to make the essential oils that I'm putting in my family and on my family. Because if you're putting something on your skin, it's ending up in your skin, in your body um, within under 30 seconds. That is crazy. Um, so the, that 
brings us to a lot of the labeling. The labeling is not regulated. Anybody can slap pure essential oil on a label and call it a day. Um, the FDA says only 5% of what's in the bottle has to be essential oil. The rest can be carrier oils, alcohol, synthetics, that whole thing, um, all of which is not good for you. Like we just talked about all those other chemicals before and how they're proven. Things like asthma, allergies, eczema, all that stuff is all proven side effects of these chemicals, but there is no proven safety data that it's safe for us. Um, so that brings us to Young Living Seed to Seal process, which you can visit seedtoseal.com and check it out. It is amazing. Um, I, like I said, I've personally been to their farm and I'll be to another one in June um, and it's just amazing. Um, so from the time the seed is sourced until the oil is put in the bottle, there is nothing but rigorous quality controls possible to ensure that you're receiving the essential oils exactly the way that God intended, um, with those molecular compounds still in place the way they should be. If it's distilled at too high a heat or it's not distilled properly, those molecular compounds that are needed for the oil to work the way it's supposed to are not going to be there. Um, so it's, it's important that those practices come into play. Um, so Young Living is completely completely open about their farming practices. Like I said, they are organic and sustainable, beneficial to the environment around them. Um, and the people that work for Young Living are amazing because they are treated so well from this open, transparent company. Um, anybody can go be a part of the process. I encourage you to go do it. It is simply amazing. Um, so there's no pesticides, no chemicals used on their farms. We even have crews that hand pick the weeds. Um, they still plow with horse and plows. Um, it's amazing. There is simply no other essential oil company with the pedigree and commitment to quality as Young Living. It is crazy good, guys. Um, I can't wait to visit our lavender farms this June. It's going to be amazing. I got to help distill Idaho blue spruce in Idaho. Um, crazy amazing how they do it and how passionate all the people are um, that are doing it. Um, so if you haven't already, I'm going to post the link below for seed .com. Um, It is amazing. If you want the best in your house, Young Living is the best by far. Um, so check out the Seed to Seal. I'm also going to post some photos and stay tuned. I'm going to go live on three different ways to use essential oils um, and how we can do that. All right, I'll see you soon.